Welcome back everyone. This is gonna be one of the craziest videos I have ever done on my channel. I'm gonna be opening up Upper Deck Series 2 tins for the last four seasons. So starting with 1718, and then I'm gonna be opening up 1819, 1920, and to finish things off, the 2021 Upper Deck Series 2 tin. We're gonna compare all four of them, hope for some big young guns. And, uh, oh, this is just a crazy opening because, you know, some of these are really hard to find nowadays. This one specifically was like $110. I think this one was maybe $75. So, uh, yeah, this is certainly not cheap, but I think it's going to be so much fun just to compare all of the Upper Deck Series 2 tins. So I'm not going to waste any more time because this is going to be a super long video. And uh, we're going to start things off immediately with 1718. Upper Deck Series 2. Now you used to get three Young Guns guaranteed in every tin, now it's only two, so uh, yeah, that's kind of unfortunate, but it's just the way that it is. This Series 2 one is the cheapest out of the four. The best Young Guns you can get are probably, you know, Clayton Keller, Andrew Mangiapani, Alex Nadelkovic. Uh, there was Nolan Patrick, but he's kind of just fallen off, so not so many incredible names. That being said, there are some pretty good Young Guns canvas cards. So uh, maybe we can hope for some of those. A very nice collector's tin as well if you do want to collect those. We've got Connor McDavid. And so I am going to be getting 12 packs in this specific tin. And I think there's 12 packs in the 1819 one as well. And then it drops down to 10 for whatever reason. Upper Deck decided to, uh, to do that. Oh yeah, and we used to get... There you go. Uh, so we used to get jumbo cards in these tins. So this is a Matt Murray one. Just a base jumbo card. That's pretty cool for the uh, Pittsburgh Penguins. I completely forgot about those. You're going to see in the newer tins, we don't get uh, any of the jumbo cards. Okay, so tin number one. This should be a lot of fun. A little comparison video between all of these different years of Series 2. What's cool about this as opposed to Series 1 is we also get all of the update cards. So OPG update cards, a bunch of different stuff like that. You can get pretty much the best rookies of the year. Uh, also, jersey cards, rookie materials fall 1 in 48 packs. So let's jump right into uh, the first pack of this opening. Here we go. So, uh, Jeanne Tantouin, I'm going to fly through these base cards because that's not what we're here for. But this is what we're here for. The Young Guns. Our first one is right here. And it is a flyer. It is Danik Martell. So, that's a name I don't recognize. That's probably one of the reasons this product is uh, so cheap. Is that it's uh, pretty hard to get uh, any good names. But maybe, you know, a few years down the road, this one's going to be a little more sought after. Kind of like... 14, 15 series two. That one's just ridiculously expensive now. And it used to be really cheap. Uh, Marky Rookie of Victor Antipin. <laughs> okay. Or Antipin, I don't know. Never heard of him either. So, uh, so far pretty much 0 for 2 in my opinion, but uh, that's probably gonna turn around very fast. I do like uh, the upper deck uh, flagship products because you usually get a good amount of value. This is a player who has been uh, killing it this year. Tage Thompson, Marky Rookie Retro card. So that's pretty nice. Landis Gog and a couple more base cards. So uh, we are guaranteed three Young Guns in this tin. But if we do get a Young Guns Canvas card, uh, that means we're going to be getting four. Because the, uh, the Young Guns Canvas cards don't count as uh, part of your Young Guns. So that's pretty cool. Uh, Kali Rosen, UD Portrait Rookies. Pretty nice for the uh, Maple Leafs. Okay. Yeah, I do like the uh, the portrait design for 1718. I think it looks uh, quite nice. All right, next pack. Uh, seems like another Young Guns here. Right winger. Oh, that's uh, that's Owen Tippett, I think. Yeah, there you go. That's a pretty decent name. Owen Tippett. Uh, he was a very high pick. I think maybe 10th overall. He's supposed to have a wicked shot. I haven't actually uh, seen him play. Uh, but yeah, that's uh, that's a pretty nice card there. Very cool. So uh, that's, uh, yeah, that's a very solid Young Guns. Can't complain about that one. And with the way Florida's playing, maybe uh, maybe they'll make a trip to the cup final. Uh, that would be pretty cool. Uh, here we go. First canvas card is Nino Niederreiter. That's so cool, actually. Uh, yeah, that's a very nice shot. I love the canvas cards. They look so awesome. Daniel Sedin there. All right, so uh, halfway through the first 10 already. I am going to try and go a little faster so that this video isn't you know, an hour long. All right. Uh, seems like another canvas card of Mike Smith. There you go. 
Very nice photography once again. And just a few more base cards. So one more guaranteed Young Guns in this tin. Uh, we're still hoping for either like a jersey card or Young Guns canvas, something special like that. Uh, Eric Johnson, and there you go. It's just one of the OPG base cards of Kevin Shattenkirk. Uh, OPG update base, and then just more base cards. Four packs to go. So one more Young Gun rookie out of these four packs. Ooh, this is pretty cool. This is a... Uh, rainbow foil marquee rookie card and this is another Tage Thompson so Tage Thompson hot box right here very nice he's a very interesting player uh, for the Buffalo Sabres uh, Burakovsky, Palat, Kunitz and our last Young Guns is a duck it's Kali Kosilla okay so not a name I recognize but that's all right two packs to go Come on, let's hope for canvas young guns of some sort. Ooh, this is probably... Who is that? Nolan Patrick, yeah. Okay, Nolan Patrick, UD Portrait Rookies. That would have been a pretty decent card a few years ago. Uh, hopefully he can still turn it around because, you know, being a second overall pick, he had really high expectations. So, uh, yeah, I really hope he does, you know, eventually turn his career around and can at least be a pretty decent top six forward. Uh, here we go. Last pack, Marky Rookie of Nolan Patrick once again. So uh, getting some dupes in this box. Uh, Nolan Patrick and Tage Thompson. So there you go. That was not the worst tin in the world. Now I'm just going to toss this aside and let's jump into the 1819 Series 2 tin. Now this is a $75 tin because there are some really good rookie cards in here. Uh, you've got the Andrei Svechnikov. There's the Carter Hart. Uh, the Drake Batherson as well, who's just been killing it this year for Ottawa. So uh, there are some really good names. There's also the Elias Pedersen Young Guns Canvas card. So that would be pretty awesome to pull. Uh, Patrick Kane on the front of this tin. And uh, here we go. Very nice Jonathan Marche. So jumbo card from this one. Now, once again, for 1819, we are guaranteed three Young Guns rookie cards. Uh, that goes down to two for uh, for the next year. So... Uh, here we go. Let's start things off. Uh, hopefully, we can hit a uh, big name in uh, in this one. Uh, oh, we're starting off with the Young Guns here. So, uh, UC Saros and... Uh, oh, Ethan Bear. Very nice. Ethan Bear Young Guns. That's a pretty decent name to start, uh, to start off this break. All right. I can't complain about that. I'm not too familiar with the, uh, the Young Guns pairings for... Uh, for these products so uh, maybe if you do know them uh, you know you'll know who I'm gonna get but uh, but yeah I'm not quite sure who goes with Ethan Bear for example uh, I do have a UD portraits here and it's Jordan Cairo very nice he's a super good player so that's a very nice card to get all right keep on going here let's hope for at least uh, one Young Guns canvas rookie out of these four boxes that would be pretty nice uh, here we go. Ooh. Oh, okay. No, I forgot about these. Uh, rookie Commence. Maxime Contois. I thought that was something like super special, but uh, yeah, I completely forgot about this insert. This was a thing back in uh, in 1819. Wow, this feels like ages ago, like 1819. Uh, I remember that was actually before I started my channel. So um, yeah, definitely a big uh, throwback. And then a uh, UD canvas of Jonathan Quick. Very nice card. And then some more base cards. All right. My base stack is already getting pretty huge on the uh, on the side. So I'll have to uh, take care of that. Uh, because otherwise, it's probably going to fall over everything. Uh, Young Guns coming here. Is that Eric Robinson? Okay. Yeah, not, uh, not a huge name for uh, Columbus. Eric Robinson. All right. But still a serviceable player. Like, he's... Pretty decent depth forward, but uh, yeah, nothing huge. Uh, Bogosian and a marquee rookie of Yuso Ricola. Okay, for the Penguins. And some more base. Okay, so six packs to go. And I don't know what this is. I think, uh, oh, there you go. Dougie Hamilton, just a retro update card, not a rookie card. And some more base. All right, come on. Need to hit. Uh, need to hit a good young guns out of one of these. Otherwise, this is gonna be uh, pretty brutal. Dominic Cahoon, UD Portrait Rookies. 
All right, four packs to go. And uh, come on, this box so far has not been great. Uh, Ethan Bear is decent, but you know, when you pay $75 for a tin, you're hoping for something a little better. Uh, Dan Vladar, Dan Vladar Young Guns. Okay, that is not terrible. He's uh, now with Calgary and it's a pretty decent goaltender, but um, not <laughs> worth anywhere near the uh, the price of this tin. So maybe I can try and pull a UD canvas here. That would be pretty decent. Uh, seems like, it oh, ho, ho! never mind. I thought this was going to be a regular canvas. Well, this is a Dylan Dubé program of excellence, UD canvas. He was captain for, uh, for Team Canada. And uh, wow, that is a super rare pull. Nice, 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 nice. That is awesome. Okay, that's uh, that's a very rare pull. Okay, yeah, those are one in 192 packs. So uh, certainly beat the odds there. And a jersey card is coming up. That is awesome. And I just spoiled it. It's a Penguin Zach Aston Reese rookie materials jersey. So uh, not bad. Not, uh, yeah, I can't really complain about that. That's very decent. Uh, last pack in this tin. Maybe uh, one last good card here. Come on. Uh, Marky Rookie of Jordan Cairo. There you go. Jordan Cairo, Marky Rookies. So pretty decent tin once again. Nothing insane, but, you know, also not terrible. So yeah, not bad. Let's uh, jump into the 1920 Series 2 tin. Now, this one is so hard to find now. It is loaded with stars. You've got the Kale McCarr, Nick Suzuki, Kirby Doc, Oliver Wallstrom, and uh, you know, there's even Philip Zadina. Like there's so many uh, big names in here. It would just be amazing, especially right now to pull a Kale McCarr, just with the way he's playing. And uh, you know, his uh, rookie cards have just blown up over the past few weeks. So here we go, Austin Matthews on the front. And uh, what's different about uh, now 1920 Series 2 is we're not going to get a bonus card on the top. We're actually going to be getting only nine of the Series 2 packs, so only two guaranteed Young Guns. But uh, there is a special bonus pack as well in this box, and it's right here. It's the 1920 OPG Glossy Rookies pack. So this should be fun. Maybe uh, we can hope for like a Jack Hughes or Kale McCarr, one of those. Uh, just as a little bonus in the opening. Very uh, nerve-wracking to open this up today. Uh, yeah, it's super hard to find this uh, product now. Here we go. Let's uh, open up the Glossy Rookies pack. Kale McCarr one would definitely be a pretty nice bonus to get here. Uh, so Barrett Hayton, Glossy Rookies. And oh, that's a pretty nice one. Jack Hughes. That's a Jack Hughes Gold Glossy Rookies. And then a Rasmus Sandine regular one. All right, Jack Hughes, can't really complain about that. That's a pretty nice one to get. Here are the odds. Uh, Young Guns Canvas card, once again, would be pretty awesome. So uh, hopefully I can get uh, my hands on one of those. Uh, Jack Hughes would just be insane. Uh, here we go. So the first pack, uh, this is an OPG update card, and it's just a base of uh, PK Subban, and then just some more base cards. So uh, ooh, this one actually feels a little thicker, maybe jersey oh i don't think so uh something different though i think oh first young guns all right first young guns rookie here craig smith and uh guillaume brisebois ooh, ooh, ooh. not a great name that is uh that's unfortunate guillaume brisebois is not exactly the player you want to pull um he's a defenseman but you know not even anywhere near being a uh, kale mccarr that's all right, though. UD Canvas. Oh, Young Guns. <gasps> yes! Yes! Let's go! <laughs> Jack Hughes! Yes! No freaking way! Yeah! Jack Hughes, Young Guns Canvas, man! Oh, let's go! Let's go! Yeah! Jack Hughes! Oh, yeah! What a pull! Wow, that, that probably makes... You know, this entire break, Jack Hughes, what a, like, amazing player, and, uh, wow, 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 what a freaking pull, let's go, oh, that is amazing, wow, oh, I'm so happy, that is amazing, uh, yeah, that, there you go, that's, that's a massive pull, 
I've got, you know, one touch holders on the side. So uh, I will definitely uh, be putting that in a one touch. Oh, wow. That's a ridiculous pole. I'm not actually quite sure what it's worth, but I'll definitely have found it earlier and put it down below. Oh, what a card. Let's go. Oh, that is massive. Oh, oh and I think, uh, I think I got a jersey here. Let's go. And it's Eric Brandstrom. Rookie materials. Jersey card. Nice. Nice. Oh, let's go. Oh, that's awesome. That is so... Oh, that is so cool. Okay. Let's, uh... Let's keep going now. I still am uh, supposed to get one more regular Young Guns rookie, so... Uh, here we go. I think... Oh, no, this is a Portraits. And it's Adam Fox! Nice! What a tin! This is a crazy good tin! Oh, my God! Oh, that's... That's amazing! All right. Wow, this tin has been uh, just loaded so far. All right, I want to keep going just so I don't uh, run out of memory because, uh, yeah, it would suck to lose this video because uh, it's been so good. Max Pacioretty UD Canvas card and just a few more base cards. Oh, wow. That is amazing. I think I've got a Young Guns coming here. Uh, yep, second Young Guns here and it's, ooh, Alexander Volkov. Okay, Alexander Volkov Young Guns, not uh, not terrible. Can't really complain about uh, about that when we get the Jack Hughes, right? Uh, yeah, <laughs> that's that's awesome. Lean Bergman UD Portraits rookies. Okay, and then just some more base cards. Wow, that is so cool. Um, <laughs> oh, that that feels good. It feels good to hit a big card. Oh, that's awesome. And we're going to finish things off with a Jesper Boakvist Marquee Rookie Update card. Very nice. All right, that was the uh, the super expensive tin. Now we're going to finish things off with the 2020-2021 Upper Deck Series 2 tin. Now this is another one I haven't ever opened, so uh, I am hoping for, obviously, uh, Romanov Young Guns would be awesome for me. Uh, maybe a Stutzla or Kaprizov would just be crazy. Uh, there's also Dylan Cousins, Nils Hoaglander as well. Uh, there's a bunch of good rookie cards in uh, in Upper Deck Series 2. So uh, maybe, you know, this video can just be legendary and I can get another one of the uh, the bigger ones. Now this time it's John Tavares there on the top of the tin. And here we go. So another OPG Glossy Rookies pack, just like the uh, 1921. Uh, here we go. Let's start off with the... OPG Glossy Rookies Pack. This box was about $45, I want to say. Probably about $45 I paid. Uh, so here we go. We're going to start off with a Connor McMichael Gold Glossy Rookies. And then a Bowen Byram Regular One and a Connor McMichael Regular One. So there you go. Regular versus Gold. All right. Let's, uh, let's start things off here. Here are the odds there on the back. Oh, what an opening. Come on, let's... Uh, <laughs> Let's finish things off strong. Uh, Romanov Young Guns would just be amazing. I've been uh, trying to get one for ages. It would be so cool to pull one. Here we go. Uh, first. Oh, nice. <laughs> Alexis Lafreniere. Marky Rookies. Oh, that's very nice. Wow, I can't complain about that. Uh, that's a very nice Marky Rookie card. Oh, let's go. Alexis Lafreniere. Just a beast. Oh, that's so cool. Uh, he's definitely going to be, you know, I, I still have faith in him. I know some people have given up. He has way too much talent to uh, to be a bust. So uh, that's just my opinion. Oh, maybe a French card or no, it seems like a base pack. That's actually my first base pack of this opening. So uh, there you go. <laughs> Next pack. Come on, let's, uh, let's get something big here. Uh, seems like a Young Guns coming. First one here. And it's Mackenzie Entwistle. So not even uh, close to being one of the big names, <laughs> but that's okay. Um, here we go. This one feels pretty thick as well. So maybe another Jersey card. No, no, no Jersey card. Um, oh, something here. UD portraits and it's another La Prignere. What? <laughs> what a, what a crazy opening. My goodness. Uh, yeah, that is cool. Well, if he does, you know, end up being the player he was supposed to be, those cards are going to be 
Very valuable, I can guarantee that. So lots of value here in this opening. All right, here we go. Next pack. This is Mikhail Burdeen, Marky Rookie, regular card. All right, uh, five packs left to go, I believe. Let's just see if I can get any other big young guns here. Uh, Sam Steele, Kyle Connor, and a Cam Atkinson UD Canvas. All right, and just some more base cards. Here we go. So I am guaranteed one more Young Guns rookie in this box. Seems like another OPG card coming up. And this is another Marky Rookies of Jill's Sen. Okay. Or Jill Sen. Not quite sure. Uh, two packs left to go. Definitely one Young Guns and maybe something else. Maybe another Canvas card. Seems like another Portraits card. Another Portrait Rookies of Nikolai. Oh, I'm not even going to try that last name that's like nishkov or knish i don't know uh yeah there you go last pack last pack mojo come on let's uh <laughs> let's find a ridiculous card here in the last pack uh okay so young guns and a dazzlers so the young guns is oh chase prisky so uh nothing big there and a brent burns dazzlers orange dazzlers very nice all right, there you go. Thank you so much for watching this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. It was definitely a lot of fun to make. Uh, but yeah, give me a thumbs up if you liked it because uh, this was a super expensive break. As always, I hope to see you all next time.